peak giving season for some local charities and nonprofits. WDRB Stefan Johnson explains why there's a new concern from a local charity that helps veterans across the country. Stefan. USA Cares was created to support veterans and their families, but there's concern allegations involving another veterans organization could scare away some potential donors. And I came here to Fort Knox in 2001, July 2001, to compete for an ROTC scholarship, was awarded a scholarship. When Ashanti Milo joined the United States Army after the 9-11 attacks, she was also joining the family business. I have two older brothers, they're active duty Navy at the time, and so, and that was my motivation to go. After two decades of service to her country, Milo retired last week. So 20 years, two months, and 15 days of active duty federal service. She's no longer on the clock, but you could say the meter is still running when it comes to her bills. So right now, what I reached out for was, was for rental assistance, because right now I have zero income coming in. Milo is getting financial help from USA Cares, a nonprofit organization created to help post 9-11 military veterans, service members, and their families with emergency financial assistance and more. Mission of USA Cares, it's the same as it's been for 20 years. Trace Chesser is CEO of USA Cares. This is the time that we're going to get in a lot of funds from individuals. Chesser says it's the peak giving season, but fears allegations against another veterans organization could impact giving. We've noticed that a lot of people are asking questions, and honestly, that's not us. Last month, the founder and CEO of the Veterans Club was indicted over claims he wrongfully collected $100,000 in benefits. Chesser wants to make sure people know they are two different organizations. We've been vetted by some of the highest ranking organizations that go through and dig through everything about a nonprofit. That includes Charity Navigator, a charity assessment organization. Recently, USA Cares was given a perfect 100% rating from Charity Navigator. And it was a very quick process. After doing her own research, Ashante Milo is confident she chose the right organization. And I still felt like a person that didn't treat me less than because I'm a veteran that served 20 years and needed assistance. To find out how to give or get help from USA Cares, just head to our website and click on this story. With photojournalist Jonathan McEmber, I'm Stefan Johnson. WDRB News. All right, Stefan, thank you.